as Glaston, episode 48. How to avoid edge kink in tempered glass? That is an excellent question and we get that question almost every day from our customers. And uh, before I go into the details of how you can avoid it, it's very important to understand what is actually causing the issue. And edge kink is mainly caused during the heating phase of the uh, tempering process, uh, when the glass temperature is above its transition point, when the glass is starting to become very soft. And uh, the higher the temperature and the longer the time the glass spends in that temperature, the worse the issue could become. And there's three main reasons that are actually causing edge kink. The first is that the glass is creeping between the furnace rollers. And this is the same thing that is also causing a roll away on the glass, but the phenomenon uh, becomes more visible and more severe on the edge areas of the glass. And uh, if you hit the glass too much, you will see more of the issue on the glass edges. The second is that your furnace uh, or tempering line rollers could be leveled unevenly. So the reason for this could be, for example, improper installation or improper maintenance. So it's worth checking that all your, all your conveyors are properly leveled if you're seeing a lot of edge kink on your glasses. The third one is turbulent air movement in the chiller. And in your lines, there's a lot of technology that already helps to control this issue. But if you're running an older line, uh, you might, might have to consider having some kind of an upgrade uh, done there so that you have more tools for the control. And uh, how to avoid or how to control edge lift. Uh, so the first thing is that you need to have a capable furnace. So your furnace needs to have enough heating control and enough heating power so that you can ensure that all your glasses are evenly heated and you don't end up heating the edge areas more than the center areas of the glass. And uh, if, if you have the technology to enable you to do that, uh, then you just have to check your recipe settings to make sure that you are not overheating the glass on the edges. And a thermal scanner, for example, is a very handy tool in helping you make sure that the glass is evenly heated. Uh, the second thing is, of course, to tell your maintenance team uh, to check the leveling of the conveyors. And uh, third one would be a new edge control technology that can significantly help you reduce this effect. And we, we were demonstrating this edge control technology at this year's Glass Tech, uh, where we were running live demonstrations of the technology right here from Tampere. And uh, we were significantly able to reduce edge lift on all of the glasses that we produced and we were seeing values of uh, lower than 0.1 millimeter in 4 millimeter glass, for example, which is something that hasn't been seen before in the glass industry. <laughs>